What it is guys, my name is Swifters and today I'm going to be showing you guys the secret spawn location of the mariachi car in GTA 5 Online. This car is also an easter egg reference to the movie Thelma and Louise, so it is pretty cool. So guys, as always, before this video does get underway, I would appreciate it if you'd left a like and be sure to subscribe to my channel for future Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So guys, let's get started. So guys, in order to get the mariachi car, you're going to want to come to this exact location on the map. It's located in the Chiliad Mountains State Wilderness, and I'm going to show you guys in my sniper rifle where the car does spawn. It's going to spawn right behind these police vehicles. However, the mariachi car doesn't spawn until the hour of 1900, and it's only there for about 5 GTA 5 minutes. So you have to come to this position at exactly 1900 in order to get this car to spawn. Like I said guys, the mariachi car is probably only going to be in this location for about 5 GTA 5 minutes, probably less, because, like I said, this car is a reference to the movie Thelma and Louise, and by the end of that movie, the two main characters decide to drive a car off the Grand Canyon in order to evade the police, which is basically what's going on right now. So, what you're gonna have to do is snipe the driver out of the car in order to prevent them from driving off the cliff. However, if you actually want to watch them drive off the cliff, it is pretty funny, it's exactly like the movie, and there's a huge explosion when the car does hit the ground. Now that you've killed the driver, you will have the cops on you, so you can either outrun them or you could always call Lester in order to remove your wanted level. I decided to go straight to the car in order to get it before the cops took it away, but as you guys can see, I failed absolutely miserably, so I had to make my way back up the mountain. Now guys, when I did manage to make my way back up here, the car was still there and I was able to get inside of it and drive it away. I think this car is super cool looking because it has guitars and a sombrero in the back. If you look closely, it also has a bottle of vodka and it also has a Mexican flag, which makes this car super unique looking and it will make a lot of people wonder how you did get this car. So guys, that's all I have for you in this video. If you did enjoy it, I would appreciate it if you'd left a like and be sure to subscribe to my channel for future Grand Theft Auto 5 content. Now guys, before I go, this is my second upload of the day. So guys, if you want to check out an awesome some Liberty City Easter egg from GTA 4 found in GTA 5. Be sure to click the link in the description. Until next time guys, this has been Swifters. I'm out. Peace.